You're listening to Robert Kelly's You Know What, Dude? on the Riotcast Network, riotcast.com. Hey, everybody, it's Monster Voice from... Shut up, Lewis! Shut up, Lewis! September 6th through the 9th, Bobby Kelly's going to be at Side Splitters, Tampa. Good strip clubs. That's what I've heard. This is what I've heard. And then West Nyack at Levity Live, the 13th, 14th, and 15th. I'm going to be there opening for Bobby, so you should come. Get a little double dip. Shut up, Lewis. And then he's going to be at the Laugh Out Loud Comedy Club in San Antonio, Texas, starting September 20th through the 23rd. So go see Bobby Kelly live and listen to the You Know What Did podcast on Riotcast.com. Hey, gang. This is Colin Quinn. This is Jim Norton. This is Dennis Leary. This is Opie from a lot of things. This is Burt Kreischer. Stan Cook, and you are listening to Robert Kelly's You Know What, Dude? You Know What, Dude? You Know What, Dude? This is Robert Kelly's You Know What, Dude? You Know What, By the way, I, I already I know that mic, Kelly Kelly's going to fucking yap a lot on this one because Bobby's not here. I already know. She's in a yappy she's mood. The, he, well, Bobby's the All right, so wait. Hold on. So first of all, let's let's go through a couple. Dan, you are the host. Bobby has no, reactivated. No, You are the host How, of this show. Why would Bobby show? You're the host? Period. You're I, the host. Right, and I am the czar of the network. Come on, man. And right. I overrule. All right. You are the host of the show. Fine. Step up to the plate, buddy. All right. Next, who's going to be the one to tell Kelly to shut up? Uh, I think Aww, Joe List. Geez. He's clearly I got think venom. We can all split. Yeah, we can all split. So it'll be a community thing. A community shut up. Wobbly ring. Joe's the only one here who's allowed to tell me I'm a cunt. I said it one time. I don't like it. Bobby's people are telling me what to do. That's how Hollywood Bobby's gone. He sends a representative now. He went Hollywood. People. Bobby's gone to Hollywood. Yeah, that's Bobby. why he's gone. Three. Right. And Dan? Uh, I mean, take it away, motherfucker. Oh, you, I thought, were you already recording? Oh, yes, we are. Oh, okay. <laughs> Did you just stutter, oh. you fucking loser? <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, Lewis. <laughs> I'm getting all these, I'm getting barked at by like secondhand it. people. <laughs> Soder tried to zing Lewis and introduce him at the same time. <laughs> yeah. I'm sorry. Yeah. Lewis Gomez. Yeah. 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 Oh. <laughs> I believe, I believe that it's not a single host this episode. It's two hosts, Joe List and I. Oh, how Robert, about that? Whatever. I don't want credit for this sinking. <laughs> yeah, what? <laughs> uh, what? Whatever bow you want to put on this steaming pile of shit, it's yeah, on yeah. you. Well, that bow is on Lewis's microphone. Joe, right if now. you want to co-host with him, you can have it. You, you got you to tell people who. All right, there. well, let's let's well, let's people let. Oh, we needed a bell uh, every time he stutters. It goes ding, ding, ding. Dan already gets the bomb fucking bandana. This well, it's a new episode of You Know What Did. You Know What Did. Sans Bobby Kelly. Bobby uh, Bobby got a pilot and he left. <laughs> and this no. is it. Where did he fly him to? Uh, Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> All right. Bobby would have never. You know what? Here, here we go. And <laughs> just as I was Yeah, you was No, I thought that was not. great. No, no, don't give it to him. That was a good fucking no, job. No, no, no. It was a little hacky, but it was think fucking these great. these fucking idiots listening know what a pilot is? I didn't mean to call you guys idiots. <laughs> if I get one more tweet about my small mouth, I'm going to fucking kick some. You know, I'm going to be pissed. <laughs> Joe, Joe List is a dog's asshole sized mouth. <laughs> 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 it can't be on Dude, fire. Joke of the yes. day in one minute. Uh, What's up? Fire. That's, he's starting off on fire. Well, we That's don't have Bobby, but we do have Louis J. Gomez, uh, obviously. That, that we is- got Joe List. Don't Joe, don't mention my mouth list. What the fuck? I'm the truth when Bobby's here and I'm whatever? Well, I think Lewis is painted you in a corner. By the way, I like the mouth jokes. You can go back. I started them. It's when these strangers, I get like nine texts in a row, <laughs> tweets being like, you faggot, you got a small mouth. I'm I like, saw I don't even know you, motherfucker. I saw that on Facebook. One guy wrote, look at that faggy small mouth. Yeah, and then, and then like my aunt is like, Joe's cool. Because yeah. <laughs> like, uh, it was your uncle that wrote it? <laughs> ah, Jesus. What All right, and fine. Rob Sprantz said, Sitting in Bobby's chair. That's right. You're our stepdad for don't the evening. Don't worry about DeStefano. <laughs> yes. And hey, I don't know. Chris DeStefano. Who? Who doesn't care? Chris DeStefano. Yeah. Who is that? Who? <laughs> Nobody cares. He's the boy band comedian of New York. That's beautiful. He's gorgeous. God damn. If you guys you go look that? him up. Do you really think that? 
Let's you appreciate had, that. That you're beautiful. Yeah, you're a gorgeous man. I mean, from, I feel like people. I feel like maybe for a comedian, but I'm not like not in real life. No, is, no, no, like, not, is it weird that Lewis already is getting gay vibes towards Chris? <laughs> <laughs> the show they, is the show. Chris, is a, we should take our shirts off and hug. The show is a who's who of why are we listening? <laughs> <laughs> Dude, Chris head on is beautiful from the side. His forehead is longer than the rest of his face. Right. But I got hit. That's right. from an injury, though. What happened? Chris just admitted he's beautiful. I got hit in the head with a baseball bat. No, you didn't. <laughs> Did you bad. really? I swear to God. Could you get more Brooklyn every Fucking time I talked to That happened like, in Staten Island, actually. Was it playing baseball or was no, it a real? No, it was not playing baseball. All right, what was it? Somebody, I got a cousin, Christina DiStefano, who's <laughs> just having a new kid. <laughs> this is um, going to get racial. She, uh, <laughs> yeah, fucking Mooley. No, I'm joking. Whoa. Uh, oh. Oh. That was a joke. Oh, that, was a, that was just a, I'm totally cool with it. Hi to all our black <laughs> listeners out there. Totally okay with that. Keep Can on going. Just, uh, we're five and a half minutes in, and I'd like to thank Dan Soda for the introduction. Thank you so much, Oh, shit. Dan. He didn't even introduce Dan. <laughs> <laughs> I thought, I no, fucking, no, no, no. I'll fucking I wait for him I, to do it. I'm not going to be a shithead and stop everyone and do it. I was Thanks wondering, a lot. I was, wondering, I was wondering how long I could go. Yeah. You did it on purpose? Oh. I, I said Kelly Wobbly Roo, didn't no. I? No, nope. you totally forgot. You to. were waiting. You forgot. Yeah. I meant to. We should also <laughs> pretend, well, it's too late after I say this, that Bobby is coming and then just see how long Well, now they you can... just told the whole... Yeah, I know. Nah, he's... He, he's sick. Lewis! Uh-huh. <laughs> uh-huh. What, he lose his voice? Is that why I don't even you? know where he is. He got he say, I already lost his voice. Yeah, no? he, yeah he's not well. He's not well. Yeah, he lost his voice. He needs to. He needs to save his voice. It's because he was trying to scream over Godfrey in the uh, readings. <laughs> Bobby <laughs> Kelly is losing <laughs> his voice. <laughs> that was me, Joe Lewis. That I came up with that one. That's pretty good. Kelly, I'm sorry I didn't introduce you. That's all right, Dan. But I feel like I can't even have him to say it. Uh, I would actually Bobby, rather. When Bobby never lets me host this again. <laughs> <laughs> no, you can't do that. You can't do the I'm gonna tank so I never have to do it again. What? I'm not taking a dive. <laughs> what? <laughs> I think you are because it's not good. Uh, I would rather Dan Soder's Kelly impression than Kelly actually being here. <laughs> <laughs> what? It has a bigger ass. I'm just I'm being honest with you right now. <laughs> is this what's gonna happen? Okay, <laughs> I'm Lewis already defeated. Man, can I say this? I am like, so fucking tired. I can't even fight. Wake up. Compliment you, Kelly. No, your breasts look tremendous. Are we all on board? Uh, yeah, they purple? are. The okay. I mean, purple. This is really bananas. <laughs> this is really like yeah. a 50s office. <laughs> you're looking good today. I know you're sad, but, you're, but your tits look great. Uh, you got I, sass, girl. Yeah. Thanks uh, for doing all the filing. Well, thanks, Joe. <laughs> I stopped running and I've put on a little bit of weight and it's all gone uh, in my boots. In well, it's yeah. healthy it's weight. Yeah. yeah. Looks good. It is good for all you, right. Kelly. Back to Chris getting smashed in the head by <laughs> a fucking it Woolly was not a, What? No, it wasn't. It wasn't. <laughs> oh, it wasn't at all. No, I'm story. telling you. I, uh, it was I was, uh, I didn't mean. Yeah, I didn't mean to drop that. I was just in the. Somebody said really? racist, and I just became my dad for a second. Oh, um, but how did you get hit in the head with a bat? Uh, because uh, there was like a huge fight at um, Tyson Park on Highland Boulevard. In Santa <laughs> so Island. it was a bunch of blacks. All right, no, you're the it wasn't. <laughs> it wasn't. And just I don't know. Somebody was you know talking crap to my cousin. I thought I was you know I was. Is that Christina? Yeah, Christina, the, the lovely Christina. Did she start uh, talking she crap? To... Are we FM now? <laughs> no. <laughs> we're just like... <laughs> Some moolie was talking crap. I don't want to get to. <laughs> and she just drops an awful racial slur from the 70s. And then oh, uses that's crap. not that bad, though. Can I just say? He was talking poop, you know what I mean? I fucking missed you, Joe. And I you're missed fucking, you. I know we can't, no one can see it, but your gay hand movement, talking crap. Let's like a make bit. out. Mm-hmm. Let's, Let's make out. Make out with Joe. Joe. <laughs> make out with Joe. Yeah. I don't know what we're doing here. Uh, <laughs> all right, back to the back. Go. It's not a big story. I just, you know, I just tried to go defend her, and I got hit in the head with a baseball bat. That's all that Really Did you even see it coming? Um, yeah, I saw it coming. I just, it was one of those things. It's Staten Island, you know. Was it aluminum or what? 1999. <laughs> it's aluminum. It was aluminum. Yeah, I got so smoked. Dude, I got, I got <laughs> fucking smoked. But that's actually better than wood. Blood it? gushing <laughs> down my face. Like, it was bad. And then, I, you know, I ran Jesus. back to my dad's house and then... Do you have yeah, any, like, and your dad would have wanted to take care of it. Well, my dad was. What's his he was fucking no, name. That's what his your dad that's called you a actually, faggot. Now that you're bringing, actually, now <laughs> you that you're bringing faggot. that up, you're, you're coming home bleeding, stepping all over everybody. Yeah, yeah, yeah. everybody. No, it's, it's, it's up. Up. Actually, actually, <laughs> that's like because I talk a lot about my dad. That's actually the first time that I realized my dad was like clinically insane, and that he was been he had he had come from like a troubled past. Because I came home, <laughs> blood all over my face. Christina hysterical crying. My other cousins crying. They're having a barbecue. That's what Italians do in August. Do you have a cousin on Sundays in August? Yeah. I actually do. I got three. Um, and he uh, <laughs> and my everyone's crying, uh, you know, upset. We got to get him to the hospital. And my dad just fucking stoic look is just like, who did it? Like with blood, like on his hands. Like, who did it? Do you know who did it? 
<laughs> and I was like, yeah, I think I know the kid's name. He's like, what's his name? Whispered in my ear. And I whispered, <laughs> and I whispered in his ear. And I Jennifer told him. Jennifer White. And he goes, <laughs> and he goes, Harold Washington. And I swear to God. And he goes, okay. He goes, okay. And he goes upstairs, puts on a, I swear to a Christ. Suit? No. Puts on like this leather jacket and leaves the house. What? And comes back and comes back like what? five hours later. And that's oh. five hours. Did the kid ever show up to school again? Well, I never. I wasn't from Staten Island, so I don't know what happened. Oh, I just knew the kid's name because it was. I think I know what happened. No, I know. My dad never. It your wasn't like that. Your dad, your dad, but your dad, my dad fucked is that just kid. the type of guy. How like, great, great would it be if a cold case got solved? <laughs> yeah. Because, no. of, Chris, this because of this podcast, the guy's listening. He goes, "Wait a damn second. There's a no. guy. My. He said that guy that got him was wearing a leather jacket. I started. Give me the fucking bandana." Yeah. Yeah. Can I say this? I like that Chris tried to claim uh, August fucking barbecues as an Italian thing. <laughs> yeah, like Puerto Ricans aren't having barbecues. They in don't August. do that shit. Like You've everyone been to the West doesn't Side have highway? a barbecue right. in August. That's barbecue season, motherfuckers. Yeah. Yeah. Like every Italian's having um, a barbecue in August on a Sunday. That's what, what I'm saying. I had a, more to the joke where I said West Side Highway. It was gonna be like a Puerto Ricans. Yeah, okay. Be Kelly, Kelly, you are stepping into your jokes. <laughs> I, I did. I wanted to welcome uh, our photographer here. Today we've got Beatrice taking photos today. What? Beatrice? Yeah, Beatrice. Yay, She's Beatrice. fucking hot. Um, and it, and, and I what? wanted to throw a roadblock into the comedy. Hey, everybody! Let's <laughs> stop down the episode when we are getting any momentum. <laughs> I want to talk about a person that we could have put <laughs> on later yeah, you, at uh, any given time. I'm gonna do all promos. Ten room. minutes. <laughs> you wanted to feel left out. Well. I, thought, I wanted to feel like she wasn't a part of this. And say hi to baby James. Oh, oh. we got a name. Oh, yeah, we got a name. You know I it's like a boy? Yeah, like we know name. it's a boy. Honestly. Who is a baby? Lewis. Be- she's pregnant. Lewis's, that's she's Lewis's pregnant. lady. Oh, no kidding. <laughs> 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 he really just did that like an old uncle. Ah, good for you. I am an uncle. <laughs> Are you mad at me? Lewis, I, Vic, oh, all right. our f- mutual friend Vic told me a story about you uh, holding a dick. Getting oh, no, okay. Getting in trouble. <laughs> Oh, getting arrested? Yeah. What week, happened? A week ago. Again? Yeah. While, I was, while I was hosting a comedy show at Eastville Comedy Club. <laughs> You're such a piece of shit. What happened? While my pregnant girlfriend sat inside. <gasps> yeah. All right. Oh, that all happened. For what? What did you do? I, I, I've, said this on, <laughs> I've said this on three podcasts, but uh, I, I'll give you a quick version of the story. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Dan. Maybe now you're on, on the podcast. About it. Maybe I just heard about it. <laughs> I, we haven't heard about it. And this right. is, this is one, one of the I flagship guess. shows yes, of the on. network. I was hosting a show at Eastville Comedy Club. 11 o'clock show and I, I bring up Rachel Feinstein and she was having a hot day that day she, she was looking lovely. very good she looked great she that nice day tits. well Rachel goes from fucking Hi. nebbishy Jew woman to really really fucking hot let's get real <laughs> depending on the day of the week you meet Rachel Feinstein alright and I bring her up dude and I go out and there's these two kids from the earlier show and they were smoking a joint so like oh man you want to smoke and I was like ah, I'm not really supposed to smoke I promised my girlfriend I wouldn't smoke anymore and then uh, <laughs> so I was like alright fine I'll take a hit so then I took a <laughs> dude at first I look around because I'm paranoid and there's just one Asian dude on his cell phone just sitting there talking shit on his cell phone and you like, looked right. at him and you thought Asian people can't be police no <laughs> Asian, we, nobody's afraid of Asians you gotta be this afraid isn't, of cops this isn't rush hour exactly <laughs> so I take a hit of the joint I was saying that sarcastic what yeah, time of day was, was it he yeah, he, that, Kelly's already untying the bandana can we untie <laughs> <laughs> yeah so you know the deal with the bandana Chris no if you I'm bomb, sorry if, if you, you bomb, bomb a joke so I sh- okay so just leave it here yeah. tie it around uh, Chris's big misshapen forehead <laughs> Chris has but not since the implication of the bandana oh okay so That'd be a horrible intro. If this is your first time just to hear. <laughs> Bobby's like, come through the show. <laughs> <laughs> come through the show. show. You fuck up, you get a man. Dude, I fucking think it a joint. I give the get back to the kid. I start walking away. Asian dude pulls out a fucking badge. Another uh, dude rolls up on me. And uh, yeah, dude, they fuck. I didn't actually get arrested. They just handcuffed me and brought me to the station. But they gave me a ticket once I got to the station. But the best part of all. Who is, hosted? Dude, uh, well, Aaron Berg went up and he like introduced the next comic, and they were like, "What the fuck happened?" And then like they all had to introduce each other like a late night show at the comic strip. <laughs> it was brutal, dude. So you were in the middle of hosting. In the middle of hosting a show, and you couldn't even pop your head back no, in and go, well, "Here's Guys, the best get part." Arrested. The cop. I was, dude, at the, immediately. I was like, "All right, I lied to my girlfriend. I'm not supposed to be smoking pot as it is. She's pregnant. She's gonna probably leave me and abort my baby." <gasps> so I fucking <laughs> <laughs> that you went all through the you went through in that order in my head. <laughs> she's in gonna head. let the baby grow up to hate you. That's what she's gonna. Well, do. No, she's gonna leave first before she gets aborted. She's not gonna get aborted. In Eastville Comedy Club. <laughs> so fucking. Will, it wouldn't be know. the first time. Crazy <laughs> so, dude, fucking. Uh, the cop. I was like, look, dude, my girl's pregnant. I was like, I'm supposed to be hosting the show. Can I just call? Can I call at least? So he puts the, the phone on speakerphone. And oh. the, uh, so I was like, uh, Tanya, can I talk to Beatrice? And Beatrice is on the phone. And I'm like, hey, I'm being arrested. She's like, for what? I was like, <laughs> smoking weed. She's like, good. Rotten prison just hangs up the phone on me. <laughs> Way to take Do you, you want to comment? Do you want to get in and comment? Yeah. Well, on the microphone, Beatrice. Yeah, yeah I'm not. Yeah. 
prison. On the microphone, Beatrice. I didn't say rotten prison. I said that's what you get. Uh, whatever. <laughs> rotten prison kind of the same thing. Did you keep Kelly's mic for the entirety of the show? <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. Don't give me that look. Then I feel bad. Ah, oh, Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's the look, that's the look that she gives you know Bobby who. when he tells her to shut up. <laughs> oh, fuck, I can't even look over there. <laughs> Kelly Fastuka Dude, you're is. Right off. <laughs> Game Whose phone is right? <laughs> of course, hilarious. it's Louis. Oh. Sorry, hilarious. guys. I have no respect for the show. Bobby's on. I had a call from my trainer. I'm embarrassed. I hope Bobby listens to this and screams at you for that. Yeah, yeah. that was really rude. Turn your fucking cell phone out there. Turn your fucking cell phone out there. So you went to jail. I went oh. for like an hour and a half. They fucking took me out for no reason. I could have hosted the show still. <laughs> you just disappeared. I feel like every time I see you, you've been arrested. <laughs> it's happened a lot. I've been arrested. Like every time Lewis is like, oh, my roommate, I had a hunting knife and I thought I was going to murder yeah, dude, him. I, I like, just left it by the clock radio. Yeah. I didn't, I didn't no, actually no, no, no. He, he, I got arrested for threatening my roommate With life. a hunting knife. <laughs> but I didn't. I, Holy no. shit, I thought Dan was making up a joke. No, 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 that's all real. true. I didn't know Kelly's voice could go that high. <laughs> no, I didn't I know got, Dan could make up jokes. <laughs> hey, you want to start this right now? Bobby's not here. We gotta break the peace. That wasn't bad. I was gonna do a Joe's on fire dog. rant, but no one was gonna go. I was trying me. to take your back when Lewis said your ass, your mouth looked like a dog asshole. <laughs> I loved it. That was two summers it. ago. My roommate uh, called the cops and said that I threatened to kill him, and I pulled the knife on him, and I didn't do either. Well, I, you know, I said I'll kill you, but I was just talking shit. And you were holding a knife. He, no, 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 he suggested it with a knife. Listen no, 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 I shit. put the knife on top of my cable box as to say, if you touch my cable box, I'm going to kill you with this <laughs> you knife. You might as well have stabbed it into it. <laughs> <laughs> Did you, Chris, you, did your dad ever do that? Uh, like, no, I don't think he dealt with knives, my dad. He wasn't that kind of guy. I love that he just... Oh, Puerto Rican. I get what you're saying, motherfucker. <laughs> no, I wouldn't go that right, hacky. No, when he's I, right, I, he's right. I, I, uh, he had other things that we he would do. He would bats and stuff. Brass knuckles. That's the kind of guy he was. Old school. What was your drunk drawer like in your kitchen? Just like brass? Brass knuckles and b- like blackjacks and your With, dad's. Uh, we'll go to my dad's house. Yeah, yeah, it was like yeah, brass knuckles. Uh, Pian- he had, he had those steel wire. tip, uh, those, <laughs> steel tips, <laughs> those wing tips with the steel on the bottom of the heel. <laughs> hey, Chrissy, I'm missing a clip. Can you look at the drum drawer for a nine millimeter? Is this it? It's a forty five. Cash. So much Stupid. cash. Yeah. Yeah, I used to have a badasses. Gra- well, I mean, these two are me and you. Wait, I'm not. not no, I'm not a badass. badass. Has Just anyone else was. been arrested here? I've never been arrested. Oh, you no. been, what did you get arrested for, Chris? Just trespassing. Rape. I got arrested for trespassing, and then I got a, I actually, oh, actually, I got a good one. I got a trespass a, on that pussy. I got arrested. In a, <laughs> <laughs> I got a, Come here, Dan. Come uh, here in the I don't know. What do you mean? Give her that for coin, but are you crazy? That was a great <laughs> joke, Kelly. It on Pick it up off the floor. <laughs> okay. Shove it in Whoa, Lewis. Whoa, easy. Sip your beer. Yeah, yeah. Could you imagine being his yeah. roommate, how aggro he is? What? Turn on the air conditioner. Why was the air conditioning off? It's been hot all day. You wake up in the morning, he's doing cake. Fear push yeah. on <laughs> Scales tattooed on his back. Oh my god. And that's still on there. Uh, <laughs> you're talking about your dad? My dad? No, no, no. Oh, you said getting arrested. Yeah, well, yeah, yeah. I think we should so, paint the bandana on Kelly's microphone. <laughs> you Thank you, Rob. <laughs> Woo. That was a shame. Rob saved me. He's in oh, Bobby's oh, seat. Rob's Fuck off. That's Rob's hilarious. With the that attacking. joke was hilarious. You're Lewis was Kelly. answering a phone call. Chris was fucking thinking up his bullshit I'm story. Half asleep. By the way, Chris is from me. fucking. Uh, Long Island. He's not even. He's uh, from. I, I, I know. I was making a joke that he's lying well, about where he's from. Hey. I know. Fucking bandana. I'll shove Who's it in my ass. Fighting what on what now? All right. Everybody. Everybody. By the way, <laughs> go right back. can I tell you something? That gonna, fucking light bulb right there is literally white hot, dude. There's a blister <laughs> on my arm. Look at this. My Lewis, arm is blistered. Lewis right now. spent like four Holy minutes. Shit, it really is. Yeah, dude. From fucking <laughs> burning my arm on that. It's fucking white hot. Don't uh, touch it. He's been like, it. That's definitely going to Dude, he, he spent like four that. minutes talking about before we went out. He's like, you got to turn it off, Kelly. I'm telling you, it's not it's good. You really burn my pregnant girlfriend. What the fuck is wrong Why? with you people? It's nowhere near your pregnant girlfriend. It's a, it's a hot life, Beatrice. By the way, <laughs> I tied the bandana so to <laughs> Kelly and I's microphone. Why did you go so dramatic so quickly? Funny. Me? Yeah, Me? it hurts. It's going to kill my unborn baby. She's nowhere fucking near it. <laughs> I'm trying to hear Chris's story about being arrested it's not because once story, Chris though. looked in my pee hole, and I want to know Mul- if this once. man has a record. Multiple times. Uh, twice. Twice. What was he twice. looking for? I've looked at your dick seven uh, times. No, I, just, I was just checking the urethra. Uh, he's got a kid's got a whistle. He's got a kick ass <laughs> urethra. His urethra's yeah. pretty good. They call me the urethra kid. I thought it was a good urethra. Give him that, right. give him that fucking bandana. That's all right the alcohol now. coming right out. Are we out. doing the drunk show right now? Yeah. <laughs> well, you are. I am well, drunk. Hey, Dan, let me ask you something. Nice. When I saw you at Gotham Comedy Club, were you drunk that night? I had been having a couple. You look pretty bomb when I saw you. Oh. Yeah, I was doing. He comes up to me, goes, "Hey, spread your cunt." He just yeah. starts hugging. That's pretty loaded. <laughs> <You> <laughs> I got cornered in the back, uh, <laughs> and we started doing shots. 
and then that's always a that's never a good thing for me. Hmm? I go from zero to sixty pretty quickly. Can you give him another bandana somehow? Mm, no, it wasn't, it wasn't a joke. One? He was just. Lewis <laughs> <laughs> yes. fucking thinks we need to be on all the time. Yeah. Right. It was it was just was, where was the punchline? There was no joke. Uh, there was no punchline. Thirty line. seconds. Gotta keep telling laughing. a very intimate story. Uh, no, <laughs> uh, he's Cholo. embracing his inner porn. Uh, oh, he, he's tying the bandana around his head. That like is Tupac style. But you've got it. You got the bow at the front, so you look more like a lady than you do a gangster. He looks way cooler than me. You. Okay, Chris is definitely that. That totally wasn't bandana worthy. Ah, whatever. Oh fuck yeah! Trespassing, Chris, go. Well, that was, I mean, you get I get arrested <laughs> for the little stuff like trespassing, graffiti, <laughs> graffiti? all that stuff. You did graffiti. Yeah, I was that <laughs> kind of. I was a loser. Were I you a corn rolls when I was sixteen. I had corn rolls. You really did, dude. I was a basketball player in Bushwick, Brooklyn, <laughs> pre gentrification. You, you were a winger. Did, 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 did you talk all? Did you talk all? Yes, I fucking of course. You were like, what's up, son? Yes, yeah, all that shit. <laughs> did you ever what's say up? no? What's up, God? Bull, bitch what's up, God? God? What's up, God? What's up, God? I would say that shit all the time. Of course. Did you tell? Did you? You tell girls like when you were like, yeah, that's all I girls, you Dude, like, girl, the first five, six girls I had sex with were all black girls from like Project oh, Buildings. Gross. Ew. My, oh. First, oh. <laughs> my first girlfriend's name was Letitia. Chris has got a Letitia. Chris has got a <laughs> I don't know. I would say this is for sure the most racist episode. <laughs> my vanilla man's, man's coming over. <laughs> Ooh, he got cold I just rolls. imagine. Yeah. I just imagine Chris. No, he got that good like, credit, son. <laughs> yeah, son. With an open shirt and cornrows. Oh, his car got wearing. Anichi, Mecca, Rockaware, all that shit. What's up, girl? Okay, What's up, girl? I had, Ill, I had a Ill fucking crossover. I've been, I've been thinking about you all day. I don't mean to st- um, break momentum, but what's a cornrows? Cornrows? Yeah. I had my hair braided. Yeah. Yeah. I thought it was cornrows. And I would rose. come up and call Like K Fed? Yeah, and call my mom. Yeah. Like, oh, Wait, are you shit saying like that. rolls or rows? You saying rows? You said K Fed? Oh, okay. Do you, do you not know right. real fucking references Corn from this row. decade? Like a row. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what yeah. I thought. I thought you said rolls, though. She's from Australia. They just got K Fed. No, I thought I was saying it right. I got a New York accent. So fuck you. We just had two eight conversations. Yeah, everybody's talking over each other. Back up. Yeah. Bob, Bobby's losing. I just imagine Bobby listening to this episode like ah, with no voice. <laughs> <laughs> Never again. <laughs> Shut the fuck up, dude. Stop talking. All right. You know, I got arrested. <gasps> For, what? 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 No. For, were you a peeping Tom? Of course. Like, <laughs> <laughs> of course. <laughs> you're an exhibitionist. He yeah. looks like <laughs> Rob definitely looks like a peeping Tom. Well, Rob yeah. spreads his fucking weird face coming through the bushes. <laughs> <laughs> Some so girls putting on a nightgown. <laughs> <laughs> I'll never forget that face. Voyeurism. That's Why, a what? voyeurism. Oh, shit, Rob. It was a typical white urban way to get arrested. There were concert tickets going on sale for some metal band in Penn Station. What so, band? Uh, it's Iron Maiden. Okay. So we go some to... Some metal band, <laughs> one of the biggest <laughs> metal bands of all time. I know. metal band. Does this look like a metal crowd to you, dude? I know, I know Iron Maiden. Iron Maiden, they're not even really metal. You never heard of them. They're called Metallica. Anyway. So, so, um... Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. 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 You guys are like Fuck looking you. for when, it. Yo. When the chief looking isn't here, through the little engines, we'll attack each other. <laughs> when the bald headed chief yeah, is not here. Right. I knew it was coming. All right. Oh, you, you knew that I was going to display I knew talent? You guys were fucking be having it give me a hard time. All right, you. So anyway, anyway. All right, so, <laughs> sorry. So three white kids, sixteen years old. We go around the Penn Station area, and it was bad Wait, news this is at you? that time. You were sixteen. Yeah. Oh, it's just like Iron Maiden's out for like a month. They're like the <laughs> biggest thing ever. <laughs> this is like the sixties or something. No. So what were so, you wearing? Uh, probably an Iron Maiden t-shirt and jeans. Oh, I just do you, you have a mullet? Thigh high uh, stilettos. No, dude. You know what I had? I had a perm. Yeah, I had my did. fucking hair. What, perm. like, like Bon Jovi perm? Like a Bon Jovi. Perm. Uh, I imagine you having the same perm? face. <laughs> like you know how they do in like shitty movies? They're like doing like a, a flashback scene with the yeah. dude that. Photo, photo, photo. <laughs> that's what I'm imagining. You have it. Picture yes. coming out. Oh, that's uh, awesome. Yes. Rob, you just right. went up a few notches in my belt, man. So anyway, so, awesome. perm? so while I, look, I think she wants yeah. to fuck you. I think that's what that means. You went up a few notches in my belt. You want to meet the smashing? You went up a few notches in my panties. So By the way, Lewis, you would love this. I was gonna call you last night. I was playing you. UFC, and I did a, a random. I picked my, my creative <laughs> character versus a random. Guess who I drew? Uh, Mark Kerr, Smashing Machine? Don Fry. <laughs> Don Fry, nice. <laughs> it was like two in the morning. I was like, I want to call Lewis. Oh, wow. Holy Pass shit. Around. Rob, like how lesbian. is it possible that you look more like you have AIDS there than you do now? <laughs> it's impossible. Wow. What? That it looks like Freddie Mercury horrifying. on the way out. <laughs> <laughs> so anyway, oh, I like it. The day before they announced it. You like that one, Joe? Looks like Tom Cruise in Philadelphia. Oh, 
So, so anyway, we're so we're so nervous to be upstairs because it was it was bad and we were scared. So we went downstairs and on Penn Station of that big staircase. So I'm sitting on the steps and there's a black dude shooting heroin like four steps behind. Oh, this of course, was, yeah, this is yeah. like and real he, New York, right? This is like it's cleaned up now. It was much worse back then, like. 50 years ago. So oh, I have black guys don't do drugs anymore. <laughs> 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 yeah, fucking dude. <laughs> it's like with so Super like, Boston. You fucking telling me black guys don't do drugs? So, so, the, so the guy, give him the bend give down. Yeah. So, uh, <laughs> Misplaced accent. So the guy goes, hey, white boy. Hey, white boy. I swear to God, he actually said, hey, white boy. And I look he, at him. He, he knew goes, immediately he was talking about him. Right. He was the whitest <laughs> guy. Yeah, the only white boy. miles. Or the guy was just doing his uh, Clubber Lang impression. <laughs> and Rob got scared. <laughs> so he goes, I mean, not, not this one on. <laughs> yeah. 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 <laughs> so he goes, tell me if any motherfucking cops are coming. And I'm like, I don't, I don't want to do it. Tell me if any motherfucking So I'm, you know, scared shit. So my two friends, of course, bolt, mm-hmm. you know, as friends would be. He goes, don't you fucking leave. You leave, I'm going to fucking come and stab you with this needle. Those are white friends. Those are yeah. white friends. So oh. I'm standing you know, yeah, there. And so I'm, I'm going to stab you with this yes. needle? So I'm looking for a cop for the guy. And of course, a fucking cop starts coming. And I go, cop's coming. That's all it took. Two minutes later, I thought it was gone. A cop walked away. Two guys go, fuck, they throw me against the thing, put me against the wall, handcuff me, handcuff this guy. And I'm going, I'm not with it. You know, you're trying to tell yeah. the story already. So they bring me in a Penn but Station But you look exactly jail. like a heroin addict, right. so. <laughs> no, believe it or not. like, yeah, okay, buddy, you're yeah. not with it. Yeah, of course. But I think they had an idea because they put us in two separate areas because I was like, all I kept thinking of going down is, you know, Jesus Christ, you should be in this cell with this black dude. You should have done this when the cop was coming. You should have just looked at the cop and like nudged down towards the guy. <laughs> <laughs> right, you know what I'm saying. <laughs> He's ripe for the picking. So the cop, <laughs> one of the cops comes back in and he goes, look, man, I know you had nothing to do with it. I know what you did. I believe your story. I'm like, okay. He goes, but I can't let you leave until like noon. So, of course, the tickets go on sale. I missed everything. Oh, so you missed that. Yeah. This yeah. Whole night. Ticket missed it. Missed it. You had all. to wait in line and fucking actually buy tickets. Yep. Like a douche. Back then, there was no fucking internet. And you couldn't lucky leave, there's electricity back then. Couldn't leave shitty comments <laughs> on internet clips that you watched. Nope. What did people do before the internet? So wait, n- none of you guys got arrested? I've never been arrested. No. Not, not even put in cuffs? I've done a nope. ton of illegal things. I'm I've, ru- I've like ruined people's lives before. But I've Whoa, been what? Whoa. What kind of fucking Ted Bundy <laughs> shit is that? She joined the podcast. Oh. <laughs> that was awful. That was great. That, that was, was a good one. You're such good a good one. writer. That's terrible. Oh, that's so. the nicest thing anyone's ever said to me. <laughs> no, uh, don't kill him with... Yeah. Uh, <laughs> let me joke. How did you destroy people, Kelly? Uh, I, uh, I, I, uh... Dan put his oh, Larry uh, King face. <laughs> I got real... No, because this fucking psychopath has been walking among us for months. <laughs> and I don't need her being like, Well, I had to leave Australia because a man wronged me and I killed his family. <laughs> Never have sex with a married guy. Or else I'll kill your family. <laughs> no, uh... I uh, there was a girl I went to high school with, and she was. Like, oh, this is gonna get. Oh, you yeah. yeah. killed her! Oh my god, did she kill herself? <laughs> uh, is this some Carrie shit? No, I didn't know what eating she pussy was, was, and I actually <laughs> ate her pussy off. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm not making cheeses. <laughs> We're getting Fat Kelly back. Uh, I'm I, I love Fat Which Kelly. means Fat oh, my Kelly's titties. <laughs> yeah, oh, coming Chris, back. Chris, you're the only one who, know, who knew me as Fat Kelly. I did know you as Chris, Fat Kelly. Do you know Chris yes. Stefano was the first person I you ever met in New York? When I moved to New York, and yesterday was my two-year anniversary. Yeah, I oh, knew you two oh, years ago. Oh, I was going two to years. Two swallows. No. Um, uh, <laughs> I'm no, joking. We never did. We never did. How big was she? I, you were, I mean, look, you ago. were heavier, but I wouldn't describe you as a heavy girl at all. Honestly. He would describe you as a fat girl. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, a <big>. fat fuck. <laughs> no, you weren't heavy. I, I don't think anybody, I don't think I anybody ever said, obese. like, nobody ever said that fat girl from Australia. Okay. I did. They just say that. They would say that fuckable girl from that Australia. That fuckable girl yeah. from Australia. Excuse me, yeah. that fat girl that's moved here from Australia. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I had a booty. Fat kangaroo I never, fuck. No one ever talks about booties in Australia, but when I moved here, people were like, Nobody says booty here either. You want to take me? You're a fucking pirate. I had a big <laughs> ass. <But> anyway. <laughs> Look at that booty. Anyway. I've got a nice booty. <laughs> got a nice, but dunk the dunk. <laughs> do, do you guys are going to give me a cake pirate. for my tea anniversary? Yeah. All right. You uh, are going to give you what? what? Am a I going to get a cake for my tea anniversary? Of course she wants cake. Look at her. She's like, can I have cake? <laughs> you know she wouldn't have to have cake back now. <laughs> I'm quitting smoking. Let's do it. You quit smoking? Uh, I'm, I'm on the way out. Congratulations. I'm like a day away. Uh, anyway. Kelly let me tell She's going to blow up. Gaming way. Bobby's coming down, and we're gonna we're gonna high five each other. <laughs> you guys are two ships <laughs> passing in the night. And Kelly's the ship that goes. <laughs> 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 
Dance, dance on fire, dance on fire. Oh, that's the first dance one I've ever got. Is it? Hey. 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 It's right. been a long time coming. Wait, that's the first undeserved dance on fire. <laughs> <laughs> it's amazing. That right. is true. Let me tell you how I ruined someone's life. So a uh, girl I went to high school with, she was like the girl, like the most popular girl, like big titties <laughs> and a body and always like uh. was dating the older guys. And she like dated like a famous football She's at one stage. She's a hot Sheila. Yeah, and like we were in the same <laughs> friendship circle. And she was a real bitch to me. So much of a bitch, like she would have a party and not invite me. She's like, like you're so fat, Kelly. Kind of you're not coming to my party. Well, fat things Kelly. haven't changed because we actually had a two-year anniversary party. <laughs> For you, without <laughs> you. <laughs> it was at Joe's. And we also invited her. She's here right now. Yeah. <laughs> Come on out. I hate you, Kelly. She's <laughs> You ruined my life, Kelly. Uh, <laughs> All right, so how'd you ruin her life? So no card? Okay. Uh, uh, no, I don't do it. Anyway, uh, yeah, so a few years later, I was sitting down with a friend, and he's like, so did you, I've never told anyone this story, and I hope it doesn't come back to bite me. Anyway, uh, he said, uh, hey, did you hear that so-and-so has been chosen for the newest big brother? Wait, what's, right? her, na- what's her name? You give her first her name. name. I'm not what's telling her name. name. First Jane. Jane's her name. You're no, making that's a fucking name. That's a fake name. I can't. I really can't say her name. Why? Yes, you can. They don't have internet. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. There may shit. be some legal shit going on. I she can't talk mention about. the name. Is it like a crazy way. unique name? You it's Rumpelstiltskin. She did some real bad shit then. No, yeah, I she's did. like, I can't know Oh, God. <laughs> if, I tell, if I tell the end of this story and you guys fucking wail at me for it not being an interesting story, I'm going to just leave. I'm going to go. There you go. I, you know what? Let me loosen the knot on the bandana. <laughs> <laughs> Why don't you keep going so with the story? He said, he said, and this is when Big Brother, this was said, like. Hey, do you want to help me rape that girl? Oh, easy. Will you hold down a wrist? That's not funny. I don't like rape jokes. Anyway, no, okay. Uh, no, they're hilarious. What? <laughs> Kelly needs a blow before they <laughs> get show. Get to the story. The I've had a lot of coming. All right, get to the story. Anyway, it's been a long day. Uh, yeah, so he said, this is when Big Brother was huge. Like, if you weren't Big Brother, you would be Wait, a how huge? As huge star. as like Kelly? Or? <laughs> Bigger. That was, right. can we? Was that? Yeah. Come on. Yeah, you uh, can't, yeah. Kelly, you can't call it if you laugh. And also, <laughs> he is right because you guys have shows over there that are really big that <laughs> suck over here. Okay. Like Big Brother. And can, no, but not can you anymore. get the bandana on a question? <laughs> <laughs> How big was she? Bandana. Nobody laughed. I'm, like, oh, I'm looking for information here. Anyway, no, this is a, this was like eight years ago when Big Brother was like was was a big show. Like you would be famous if you got on Big Brother. Like the real world. Remember when right, people were like yeah. that? Now it's Lost's Charm. Anyway, back there. So I found this there. <laughs> Holy shit, these are a lot of words. She speaks three times as fast as anybody else as well. You want yeah. to Why don't we reco- but, we'll record this later and then put it in like an ad in the middle of the show. Bobby's gonna Just be get ba- to the point. Bobby's right. gonna, Bobby's gonna be back. Right. 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 Stop it on it. Tell her to shut up. Oh my god, it just channeled Bobby. <laughs> <laughs> that was weird. You got it. From the other side. He's I, the puppet master right now. I will blow Lewis if this story ends in the next 25 years. <laughs> My dick will not fit in your tiny mouth. Right. So somebody's on. <laughs> now that's comedy. Yeah. All right, now that we're off that, that story. Chris, don't you have a story about anything? <laughs> I got a high sperm count. I can talk about my sperm. All right, so Big Brother's big, yada, yada. She's going to so get on. I rang up a newspaper, and I dobbed her in and said, she's going to be on the new Big Brother. They published what I had said, didn't mention my name, and she got dropped that day from Big Brother, and they were supposed to be doing it that night. So she never got to be on the show, cause they, and they dumped her on the day that they were supposed to release her into the house. So, she was ready so, you, to ruined, so you ruined somebody's but what career. But what did you say about her? That, that I made just them not, no, I revealed her identity. You're not supposed to mention uh, that. Yeah, I right. said, her uh, name is this, and this is where she works, this is where she's from. I rang up, left a message. And they published it. They were like, apparently, one of the new people from the house is so and so. And she had a dog cleaning business and blah, 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 blah. You and just then, gave it away. Oh, oh right. Google right. Australian <laughs> dog cleaning business dropped off Big Brother. I'm going to find the name right now. And, uh, <laughs> Please do. Please do. And they Chris dropped can it. Find this. They fucking dropped it Wait on the day. Did they you were say like, a dog cleaning business? Yeah, like they, uh, she goes around what to your house. What the fuck is that? You dog mean like, like okay. dog grooming? Cleaning. You don't call it dog cleaning. They don't like vacuum the dog. We have different words for stuff over there. Thanks, Dan. All right. What was the word I used before? Literal Dan. <laughs> Cultural <laughs> references are different overseas. So you just basically got her kicked off the show. Yeah. Oh, and that's... she was ready to go. She was going to be a huge star. No, she wasn't. It's she a reality was. show. No, You're not was. a huge star. Who, wait, on. Who's a huge star that's ever been on Big Brother? The, the Miz? Oh, Big Brother? I don't Big know. Brother. I don't know. No one. And The Miz is the only one out of fucking real world. Who else is a huge star? Uh, tech? Who? Puck. <laughs> Puck? Puck? He killed himself, didn't he? What? what? Did he? No, he didn't. Puck didn't kill himself. No, you're thinking of what you should do. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, Joe. Yeah, Joe, on. don't say that to Kelly. Her boobs are getting bigger. <laughs> Your boobs look bananas, may I say. You were able to find it. I mean, it's crazy. Okay, thank you. You have the best yeah. angle, too. You were yeah, almost I mean, down there. Really? 
It's Kelly, nuts. I enjoy your personality. <laughs> My girlfriend is down yep, a level <laughs> below us having dinner with her friend, and I'm telling you, your breasts look ridiculous. <laughs> My pregnant girlfriend is taking pictures of your breasts ever. right now, and I'm ridiculous. loving it. Ridiculous. <laughs> Uh, yeah, Joe and I that. went to a bunch of strip clubs in Montreal. Yeah, oh, Montreal. all right. Oh. Yeah, what are the strippers now, in Canada like? Do they give it away? They got cesarean scars? No, they are uh, hot. We, strippers we saw, in Canada are hot. Yeah, dude. we went yeah, to the yeah. lunch shift. We were the first. Joe, uh, <laughs> Joe, myself, and another comedian, Phil, went when they opened. We could say Phil Hanley. Can we plug his name? Yeah, Phil <laughs> I don't know. I don't know if he's got this. I hate Phil Hanley. Maybe you can, you got, I love Phil Hanley. We've got 30,000 listeners. Maybe you can say his last name. Maybe someone will Google him. And Maybe do a him fan. a favor. By the way, I hope Phil, Phil Hanley's family disowns him for going to a strip club in Montreal. That's now, what I'm saying. Yeah, yeah, what would that be? Uh, uh, yeah, oh, I didn't shit think it was tell me about the tits. He's hilarious. Well, we went there, and there was a free buffet going on at the strip club. Can you see Kelly's ears just perk up like a Jack Russell Terrier? Free buffet. You can go in and get all the free food you want, and all you have to do is pay one price. <laughs> you don't have buffets in Australia. I've got rewind voice for you. I don't even know a buffet. The free buffet was meatballs and cucumbers. Yeah. <laughs> Basically, that was it. And we all got bowls of, of meatballs, and there was like one smoking hot girl whose name I forget. Tanya. Cucumber. I Her name was Cucumber. I liked, <laughs> I liked my lady. Which one was? Oh, his. Your Soder lady? was getting. I think Soder is a good friend, and I think he has loyalty where he doesn't need to. <laughs> where I was getting like lap dances from like this twenty-two-year-old girl who was like a fucking eleven. She was like crazy hot, was and Dan hot. was like, ah. That's Joe's girl. I'm going to get one from fucking Leatherface. <laughs> she was a, she I counted was a, her rings. She was 57 years old. She was a little older. She Great was, body. And she did have some wear and tear on her face. You like the older girls, dude? Lovely dance. She had the she best body. A, she uh, hasn't Joe, bought tampons in nine years. Let's just say that. <laughs> I like girls that have had hysterectomies. She was at fucking Joe's on fire chat. Was she was. Is she drunk? <laughs> she she was was like something. I am. Well, someone let me Are you mad at me, Chris? I felt like because I was trying to make a joke that you weren't really from Brooklyn. I could never get mad. I'm not the guy that ever gets mad. He's just going to go upstairs and put on his leather jacket. I never get upset. Five hours later. He's just waiting to be walking. Off from the end train, ding! And like, You'll uh, just get one in the back of the head. Like, uh, it never, uh, like it never happened. Oh, put a fucking east end to the side of your head. <laughs> so, you got so, that dance of leather face. All right, now here's yeah. the thing. And he's and John, Joe's like, yeah, she was older. She cared. She actually took time. <laughs> yeah, but she was wearing snow tires on her yeah. fucking face. <laughs> yeah, it was fine. She cared about her social security. <laughs> she had passion. Come she on. Had, she had been, she, yeah, she had a lot of passion. <laughs> she, but she had been around the block. She knew how to dance. She was funny, <laughs> charming. You sharpened your knife on the side of her face. <laughs> <laughs> Dan, did she, was she smoking a cigarette and just goes, all right, let's do it. Uh, yeah, all right. Right. I, I high-fived her while she was giving Dan a lap dance. You get a song for 15. <laughs> 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 you want a song? So long, you remind me of my grandson. Oh, you, look at that <laughs> put him on your face. <laughs> oh, you were quite the attractive. Hey, can I ask I you about... By, she was giving Dan a lap dance. It was the Charleston. <laughs> <laughs> that should have uh, killed. Uh, that uh, should have uh, killed. That was I got it. Oh, it wasn't bad. It, it. Was, I like it. was it. almost I like vaudevillian. It. The audience is I saw dying. walking by and I said, she's not dancing. Dude, she's the doing audience, the Charleston. The audience is typing <laughs> up tweets about how small my mouth is right now. Hey, boys, can I ask you about the strippers in Canada? Do they give it away for free? You can touch their tits. It's they, amazing. It's full contact, oh, baby. You can like touch you can their, their punanis. You can stuff? suck them. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> you touch punanis. So you can suck their. You can't suck their tits <laughs> anywhere. <laughs> Real what are you quick. talking about? I went to a strip club in Jersey at Lace last That's week. That's a hooker. Sucking her tits. No, <laughs> yeah, but you're a hooker. Good. You're a good-looking guy. I was guy. sucking her fucking this Jamaican girl's tits. I can't suck my girlfriend. Yeah, exactly. If I try to do it, I thought I got get tasered in the middle of the. But hold on. How did you suck her tits when your forehead was bashing into her chest? She had huge tits. Loose is on fire. Loose is on fire. It is, man. Oh, it's funny. Uh, you really can't suck tits? You no, you can't no. suck tits of strippers. You guys don't bang <laughs> strippers? You guys can't. <laughs> I banged at least 50 strippers. So Have you really? Lying. I banged I swear to God, I'm, I'm not even trying really? to sound cool. Like, oh, I thought man. that's what happened. But you're, you're a handsome I love guy. Chris, I love Chris being the naive asshole where he's like, well, you guys don't bang every stripper you meet. You haven't banged a thousand I just start, strippers. That's what being they dead did. What are you like, a just, faggot? Every time I'm with this, like, Whoa, uh, Kelly, just like you don't the get their that. phone number. <laughs> <laughs> I have so many strippers' phone numbers. Do you really, <laughs> Chris? Really call ridiculous. one right now on the phone. I want yeah, to hear. Let's go. I want to hear one. a story. What this a one. humble brag. Here we go. Do you have like a separate What's group? Her name? What's his name? Mercedes. Naomi. I got this one. Uh, there we go. <laughs> the bandana finally leaves my <laughs> mic because of Lewis's awful male stripper joke. <laughs> and can we also reference the fact that 
Kelly called a woman's vagina Punani. She's <laughs> referencing all 90s shit. <laughs> nice rump. You got Punani. <laughs> Look at the jugs on her. She got some junk in her trunk. Uh, so can I ask, so in Canada, because prostitution's legal there, so with their strippers, you Prostitution's can, not no, legal in Canada. No, Do you know not nothing about the world? No. No, no. no. You're thinking what? you're thinking West Canada, and it's. It, I've heard in what? British Columbia... Okay. Like like they, Whistler, they, Whistler area, you can get hookers. The same way easy. weed is so legal in like, Western Canada. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's that they turn their fucking nose. They're not going to really fucking really go after you hard. So what do you say? They Especially in hockey season, they won't go near you. When yeah. you say full contact, you mean you can touch their boobs or ass? But the front? you can smack, yeah. smack butts, yeah? grab boobs. Yeah. Fucking but you can't do that in yeah. New York. Like New like grab some titties. But what about Smack the private ass. rooms? The private, private no, I was in a private room. Nothing. I was trying to get a beer. Dude, you know, yeah. they try to get five hundred dollars out of you once you're in the private room. Yeah, yeah. In the private private room. Dude. New York City, you can either have, as far as I know, last time I was around, went to clubs yesterday. You could bring, bring your own booze. Okay. What? No. No, no, no. Forget that. That's no, no, there's clubs. <laughs> no, there's clubs where you bring Joe's your own booze and then you buy it back from them. You bring your own booze, they take it, and then you buy it from them. But in New York, it's either no <laughs> like drinks and full shit. nudity, okay. yeah. or it's yeah. drinks and topless. Yeah, what yeah, about yeah. what That's about New like, York t- like I'm and I'm not I honestly like I'm not, I, right, I'm cr- just being dead serious. Like every time I've been in a strip club, I, the girls give me lap dance. I've made out with her and sucked her too. I'll tell you this. <laughs> I'll tell you this. I've gone, and fingered her. I've always. <laughs> but you're aware that you're a <laughs> very attractive <laughs> guy. But right. I'm not. I'm. Not, but I don't. But I. You didn't say no. I don't think that I'm not. No, but I'm not. I told you before. I'm not. It's just whatever you want to say for a comedian. That's fine. But in real life, I'm not. <laughs> yeah, um, yeah, you are. No, you are. Yeah, you're dude. Not, really. not really. You're kind of a hunk. Uh, dude, if you put, uh, if you put Soder's chin huh? on fucking Chris's face, he'd look like a fucking uh, aber- what? Fuck. Wow. Oh. Right back to you, bitch. Tire more than it was a bomb. <laughs> <laughs> I thought. All right, I got two quick points. Sorry, I thought the bandana was for bombs. Flat tires don't count as bombs. They're flat tires. Nah, that's that's still a bomb, dude. Okay, I'll yeah. take. All right, accept okay. it. Let's go to Kelly. What? Wouldn't you say I'm going to sound like a homo here? Chris is the most attractive guy in the room. Yes, easily. Mm, no. Whoa, 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 <laughs> whoa! I think I'm better <laughs> looking than Chris Stefano. It's clearly yeah. I'm not going to. It's clearly Dan oh, Soda. Dan, that fucking body roll is so gross. <laughs> it's clearly <laughs> Dan Soda. What are you doing? Um, body, um, body so roll. Hair is all uneven. Soda's a good looking <laughs> Hair guy. dips. You've all he got. You've all got a place in my heart in some way. Are you guys ignoring guy. my fucking beautiful face right now? Are you out of your fucking minds, Lewis? No. You have the voice of a guy that you have the the face of a man that's ran a prison for twenty years. <laughs> give, it a, give it to her. Right over here. All right. Right over here. <laughs> Lewis's girlfriend Jesus. says he's the best looking. Who? Thanks, baby. Uh, yeah, 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 Lewis? Lewis. Oh, there's no bias it there. Weird weird if, you're carrying his child. <laughs> it would be weird if she didn't. It'd be like if she, that Good Chris answer. Imagine she's like, I think dead. Dan's the Good answer, guy. Kelly. <laughs> Lewis, is like, Lewis has got a beautiful face. Look at him. Look at what? that face. Look at that. Yeah, Are you kidding? It's Dude, you look sick. Dude, you look so gay right now with that fucking Gillis. All right, you know what? I'm changing teams. Damn, girl. I want to fucking I'm changing teams. He looks... Real good. Yeah. Oh, yeah. So Let's all agree si- that Rob's si- young man face is the worst thing we're going to That I can sign off on. It's like <laughs> s- staring into the Holocaust. No, no, you go. Uh, Joe and I uh, not only went to strip clubs, but we hiked up Mount Royale. Yeah. Oh, Montreal. Royale. Yeah. Royale? Was that from Pulp Fiction? <laughs> Royale? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, no, give it, it to him. Where is it? Where's no, the it bandana? Was, what the fuck was Quebec? that? Come on, Dan. Uh, was it fun, guys? Was Montreal Royale? fun? Royale? I was at the Laugh Lounge. No, it was so. from the beginning of time. Uh, is where it was so from. what the mountain's called. <laughs> so, uh, pretty sure. Yeah, that's just what the mountain's called. <laughs> Is there anything interesting about the mountain? That uh, I sweat yes, the city, like a heroin addict. The city, uh, Chris, why are you texting, buddy? Chris is texting this whole fucking time. Why are you texting? Hey, hey, hey. Find out if I got to go early. He's That's sending a why. mass test message to six strippers. He's yeah. like, hey, I'm is talking it, about you. I show, you <laughs> show you Bush. <laughs> talking <laughs> about you, lovely ladies. <laughs> How you doing? Hey, Lexus, what you doing tonight? Black ones, too. That's still on there. All right, good. Montreal, strip club. Get back to it. Oh, well, I was talking about the Anthony DeVito story. That was really funny. That was hilarious. Hilarious. I love that kid. This is a guy Fellow named Anthony Italian. DeVito. Hilarious. Uh, Anthony DeVito. Uh, what's the bottom underscore? That's his Twitter. Whatever. It doesn't he, matter. What am I talking about? He also has a dead father. He doesn't have oh, a Okay, well, there's that a fucking dead father. Yeah, Come. dead dad. Boom. Uh, <laughs> boom. What do you like? The dead dad's club? High five if you've had more than one family member die. Boom. <laughs> what, immediate family? Immediate or? family. Uh, way to make it sad. Oh. High five if your dad was stabbed to death. Oh. Whoa, dude, that's heavy. 
My dad. I'm, yeah. uh, that was a pocket knife. It was like oh, less, okay. than, less than. <laughs> what do you get stabbed about. 150 times? With it? They hit an artery. What happened? <laughs> Say happy birthday to my yeah, dad seriously. and my brother this week. Lower <laughs> intestine. All right. If we're doing shout outs, get, we got to get on track. Artery. All right. Can we? Anthony, Anthony DeVito. DeVito. Oh, Anthony DeVito. Uh, well, we were in Montreal. Big festival. It's hilarious. It's fun. Everyone's there. That's nah, whatever. We get drunk. <laughs> I get hammered. I pass out in my buddy, uh, my buddy Tommy's room. I wake up. I'm staying with soda. Yeah, I wake up. Anthony DeVito's fucking you in the ass. Yeah, yeah. and I'm filming it, baby. <laughs> Covered in semen. <laughs> Italian semen. It's red, white, and blue. Oh, it's the Super best green. kind. The best red, kind. White, yeah. Red, white, and green. Whatever the fuck. I get up. <laughs> Holy <laughs> cream. I pass out at 7 in the morning. I wake up at 11. I'm like, oh, this is the wrong room. I got to go up. I get into Dan's room. We start talking. I start hitting Dan. <laughs> I elbow Dan. I'm like, Dan, wake up. And he's like, what? what what's up, man? What, what, what is it? I go, we got to call Anthony DeVito and tell him he has a radio interview. And Dan's I, like this. All right, man. Yeah. <laughs> what we were going to do is we were going to fuck with all of the people. It's a prank. A prank. Yeah. The people that do New Faces, which is a show at Montreal, they stay at a different hotel. That's whatever. Than the hotel I was staying at. So Joe wakes me up and he goes, we need to go prank. Anthony, I got the number for the hotel, awesome. and I know which <gasps> hotel room he's in. So we wanted to call him because we knew he was out late drinking. Call him and be like, "You have a radio interview, in five and you need to come do it." <gasps> well, uh, we should have said five minutes. That but, was my plan. Yeah. So Joe makes me do the call, and I just do a shitty French accent, and he's, you could tell he's like sleep because he's like, "Hello," and I'm like, "Is this uh, is this Mister uh, Devito?" <laughs> and he's like, "Yeah, yeah." Like, we have a radio interview scheduled for you oh, for, so good. for 2 p.m. And he's like, oh, okay. It's at the Hyatt? You can hear his, he immediately changes. like, oh, great. All right, great. He started pepping up. And, and then, then, he goes, then he goes, what time? And you go, two. And it was like 1130. And I was like, no, no, earlier. Because the whole point is to get him to spring out of bed. Yeah. Two and minutes. Run. So I was like, no, no, <laughs> earlier, earlier. And then Dan goes like this. I was just like, no, qu'est-ce que c'est? 2 p.m.? It's actually 1 p.m. Yeah. And then we asked him if he wanted anything, and he was like, um, what did he say? No, he, no, he, no. So he goes like this, uh, you want the, uh, the sodas or drinks or something? He goes, I, I don't know, uh, ginger ale, I guess. He's like, right. And then he goes, uh, the uh, sandwich he is? And he's like, I don't know, if it's not too much trouble, I'll take a chicken sandwich. He <laughs> like, started oh. giving us all these orders. Right. And then we asked him if he'd do the interview nude. And, uh, and he's like, oh, what? He wasn't even like, th- he was just like, I get, uh, what? And then so it was like, the Annie Letterman will also be appearing nude. <laughs> and that's when we all started laughing. Uh, oh, you should have just let him show up for yeah, the interview. Yeah, what's wrong yeah. with you guys? That, dude, that, Keep l- it. That's, well. listen, the story would have been fucking great if you gave him an, an address. Okay, don't point like, at me. We're you're the one that fucking We were both it. laughing on speakerphone and he goes, I fuck you guys. Uh, well, once you said Joe, nude, once you, you said nude, yeah, you said you nude. It. If you, you say nude, nude, then it becomes a joke. That's you told true. me to tell me you say nude. I did not say yes, that. Yes, you did. I wrote all the... That's no, fucking, you did That's a lie. Fuck this. You're fucking bastards. I didn't say nude. Fuck The only thing, the one thing I said was earlier, earlier. That's it. You did everything else. Again. And you you deserve the credit. I, really, I know. I really like the whisper in his You're voice. You're trying to pass this up. You deserve you all the credit. You are not taking any responsibility in this story. It was my idea to call him, tell us the radio yes. interview, and, and my then idea I was, was earlier. It. You did everything else. Bullshit. That's full true. You're bullshit. And you know what I can see in your face. I've known you too long. Oh, I know that you know. All right, he's kind of right. I know you know. What's that from? Good fellas. Guys, Anybody? Can you guys make out now? I know you know. I'll make out with you. I think we should all go. <laughs> I think we should all go around and rate Dan as a host so far. Oh, Jesus. Oh, I'll give him, I'll give him a butt throw. I'll rate Chris as the best texter in the history of your Yeah, dude. Put the phone down. I'm trying to find out if, there's a, if I got to go. If you keep texting, you got to go. I know. I no, know. Oh, sorry. Chris, sorry. Uh, Chris brought the hammer down. By the way, <laughs> Joe, thank you for taking the heat off. Yeah. <laughs> Chris needs to host a show at Caroline's, I'm sorry. but it might be canceled. So he's at that point where he's like, should I leave or should I stay? Because it most likely Just take it a cab. I'm sorry. Um... <laughs> Yeah, I guess I could. Just go up 6th Avenue. Yeah. All right, good. So we got Chris the rest of the show. Boom. I got to leave in like 10 minutes. All right. Joe. That's all right. Joe, Joe, you're leaving in 10 minutes? Joe, I was going to make out with you in 20 minutes. Oh. oh. I got to leave in eight minutes. <laughs> <laughs> Joe, where are you going? Uh, you have to go fight Super Mario, Mario Brothers 2, and shoot eggs out of your mouth at him? Ah, <laughs> 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 uh, that was almost, now. you know what? That was almost a bandana. That was good. That was, that was, good. That was good. Oh, that wasn't even close. I mean, it was clearly <laughs> pre-written on Wednesday at 6. <laughs> <laughs> I just see Beatrice like, Louis, will you take out the trash? <laughs> and then I'm going to say to Joe. <laughs> we look over. <laughs> we look over. You have a stupid mouth. Louis, Louis's hand is just covered in ink. He's got zingers <laughs> it's all, on it's it. All <laughs> hey, uh, it's all messed <laughs> together and running. 
I think the next one was your mouth, Lux. <laughs> the dog's asshole was the best one. That was a good one. That was great. Good for you, Lewis. Yeah, really blew your wand. Good for you. I don't think we were recording each other. We're going to gas out in the Did, first five minutes. <laughs> Didn't he say you had one for me? He said, you said next show you had a good get. Oh, me. now I can't say it. Now I got to wait. Well, I, do, I, I do have a good one. <laughs> Why? Oh, you gotta wait for yeah, Bobby? You, no, I gotta wait. No, no, I would do it, but now she brought it up. I can't just say it now. Because it's I bomb. said, I go, because you've got to prepare. So I'm trying to get rid of the fucking bomb. bandana, Kelly. Sitting <laughs> yeah. a bandana and spin. But it's my two year anniversary, guys. It, well, why do you By care the way, today so is much. mine and Beatrice's three year anniversary. Hey! Oh! Now that's an anniversary. <laughs> Congratulations. Congratulations, Beatrice, for being involved with such <laughs> for a temperamental putting up with this. Yeah. Puerto Rican for so long. <laughs> Beautiful penis. Beautiful. Not too big. Nice shaped. Show Chris your urethra. I'll show my urethra right now. You think I want? You don't think Lewis? Lewis would gladly show you. Are you guys gonna have your urethra off right now? (laughs) Smash (laughs) your urethra! No, don't. No, no. Take it out. No. All right, Kelly. Wow. Come here, Captain Whore. I'll take a look at somebody's urethra. Look at that right now. I want to see a dick. I want to see a dick. She's like fucking. Get it out. What? I'm not taking my dick out. You out of your mind? Why I'm, I'm a trained pal. I didn't realize. <laughs> I, you know, I don't I'll, just do this shit. I do this shit. F- I do this. You Wait, do, no, what do you do it for? What? I don't hold on. I, 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 do I professionally look at dudes' dicks. That's my job. Dude, I've looked at, <laughs> I've looked at literally hundreds of guys' penises. Now, Why? Hold, hold it doesn't make me feel any more comfortable. Because we're watching, <laughs> we're watching something from previous episodes that I never realized. We've had Chris on before, and we've had Lewis on a ton of times, but I've never realized that this could be. The most quasi-gay relationship Dude, meeting you of had the to, minds. you had to hear them talking before we started. They were talking about working out. Oh. And he's like, yeah, and you, you know. I bet they know, recommended a little sh- sore over here. And and something like, went, something's wrong with uh, Lewis's hand. So he was like holding his hand and examining it. It was amazing. By the way, he gave me a stretch. Wrong with your hand. Dude, it's I fucking like, cured his brachial radialis yeah. tendinitis. Yeah, he he he's like, yeah, you got to take Advil. He's, gotta, he's giving him all the But it was right beautiful. Yeah, but that's what I do. It was really tender, though, the way you were touching a little... Yeah, well, I fucking, I'm okay with my sexuality. The time of my life. <laughs> He's got sweet forearms. Never no, felt this, this way before. All right, no, <laughs> yes, I swear. <laughs> it's the truth. Right, everybody, shut up. And I owe it all to you. I hope Bob never comes you know, back. This is what's going to happen a half hour from now. I'm going to get a call from Bobby. How'd yeah. it go? Yeah. It was interesting. <laughs> this, this is going to go in a bin of all the other shows that have never made it to air. Well, they sang a song. Yeah, this is a Thursday show. Thursday. Put it out Thursday. Oh, God. This is, I think Thursday. it's a good show. I think it's a good show. I miss Bobby. Uh, I miss Bobby, too. But you know what, Lewis? I think it's been a pretty good show. I think it's especially a good show because Chris I, keeps on texting. I'm yeah, so, I'm trying I gotta to be find honest. out. I'm I never can. Maybe he's doing a transcript out. of the show. Are you <laughs> just yeah, writing down I'm everything trying. we said? I should have gotten yeah. more. Yeah. That should have gotten more, Joe. <laughs> what would you get, Joe? I'll try it again. I'll be honest. I never cared for Bobby. <laughs> I'm not getting the bandana on the second time <laughs> no, around. You, you know what? You can't, actually. Yeah, I agree. You don't get the bandana. I like Bobby. <laughs> All right, the host Soder should get the bandana for just letting us sit in I silence. I just want to see how long you guys are going to go. <laughs> I like this. I like stretching. I, it's kind of a... You know, All right, I'm taking like over. It. I'm taking over. That's UFC real. on Fox Saturday UFC. night. Oh. Who do we like? Oh, we want fights. Is it you Cortez it. or... <laughs> Stop texting. I don't want to talk about I, UFC. This is the last text. Kelly, we're out. kidding, I Kelly. Fill. I got the Philly. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah. Kelly. What? Why are you quitting smoking? Because it's. I'm done. You're done? Yeah. That was a hell of an interview, Dan. Your right, <laughs> lungs keep expanding. <laughs> that was I'm done. I feel done. like I'm looking, Catch. I'm starting to look older. She feels like she's wait, wasting all of this eating time with a cigarette in her mouth. <laughs> <laughs> you don't look old. You notice she keeps putting herself in positions to, sh- to show the breast. No, you didn't you're know that? 30. Are you 30? 30? How old are you really, honestly? I'm 30. You don't look 30. I'm 30. Thank you. Oh, no Chris problem. is going to fuck Kelly now. <laughs> yep. I can't. I'm not, I'm come in, on the next I episode. Fu- no. No. I'm not into that. I mean, no, I mean I'm into you, either. but I'm not into You would never fuck Kelly. Wait, you're not into unattractive, you annoying Kelly. girls? <laughs> Whoa, Joe. Whoa. Whoa. I think Kelly's attractive. Chris, would you fuck Kelly? Me too. It was a joke. As a guy, I would. but I, I mean, I wouldn't. But as a guy, I would. Well, I don't yeah, know if that As a guy, you would, but a comedian, you wouldn't? No, just as like a new me, I wouldn't. You know, I can't. No, what's this new you? Yeah, I can't be going after the pussy anymore. Did you guys? Did you guys? Fuck when you first moved. Never. No. Never. Did you make never. out? Never. No make out. No. Never. Never. Never, never, never even tried. Never. Even Open came mouth kiss. Just like a little no. bit. Like a never. little bit. Never. And Good. I drove you home plenty of times. And it never I remember oh. once. Well, I remember one never time. Never made the moves. No, I remember one Uh-oh. time you were on your way to Broadway Comedy 
club. I suck your and dick. you were like, you're going to come with me. I'll introduce you to people. And I was like, cool. So we were in the car. Yeah. And you know, we're driving. Wait a minute, there, you said was, you'd introduce him to people? No, he, no I tried to help her out when she first he, came. He fucking helped yeah. me out. He's a good dude. And uh, yeah, I was basking you. to do a wee <laughs> in the car. Like, I was like, I was like in the you car. Were, what? You were basking? I, I was basking to do a wee in the car. I don't the fuck you're talking about. What the car. fuck are you talking about? Did you hit him in the head with a baseball bat? Is that what you're saying? Listen. So we're in the car, and I was like, Chris, I think I'm going to wet my pants. Like, I think I'm going to wet the seat of your car. You said I'm going to pee in the cup hole. Hold on, wait, wait, wait. Oh, my God. Okay. I mean, a lot of like, it was like painful how bad it was. Anyway, we it's eventually found that we were in the car. We eventually found the toilet bubble. Cranberry juice. And I Chlamydia. Wrote, I wrote on your Facebook wall. I was like, hey, thanks so much for the list, the lift. I'm really glad I didn't piss myself in your car. Right. And then I saw the next day you deleted the message. Oh, yeah. Because uh, you had a girlfriend. Ex, right. You fucking asshole. Why would but you post she, on yeah, his why wall? Why would you do that? That's irresponsible. I had right. a boyfriend. I had a, a, a three year relationship at the yeah, time. Yeah, but he was I in would the never, Australia. Yeah, but you guys but are I swingers. I cheated on him. No, I never cheated on him. I haven't cheated on anybody. I had to, yeah. I had no choice. You've never cheated on one person? No. Ever. You've never cheated ever. on a person? No. Ever. Not even a kiss. I've cheated on every no. girlfriend I've ever had. No. Whoa. 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 Beatrice. Whoa. This is awkward. Oh, <laughs> fucking fake. You are going to be one oh. lonely baby. You remember when she yelled at you when you were in jail? This is going to be worse. Yeah. I mean, no? I can't believe you just even say that. I'm kidding. That's Jesus rude. Christ. Just Hang a child. on. The fact that you guys are like questioning the fact that I'm always. You just said that you wrecked a woman's life and then you told some boring story about Big Brother. Which I can't but... find on Big Brother. I can't find that on the but website. No, but I want to know why like you guys are so shocked that I've never cheated on a guy, which means that. Because you're a raging whore. You all cheated you on your tits. girlfriends. You well, you've said, yeah, I'm open you, about it, though. You've said before. <laughs> yeah. you, you're always talking about how you love. The, you're the smashing machine. Yeah, you you're the smashing machine, Kelly Festivity. You love to fuck dick. Yeah, but I'm hideously loyal. You love to have sex with penises. We get it. I just like the sentence. You like to fuck. You like to fuck dicks. That's such a Lewis sentence. You like to fuck dicks. Do you want to fuck some dicks? <laughs> also, no, also I'm... being surprised that someone hasn't done something doesn't mean you've done it. Like to be uh, like, if I've met a girl and I'm like, you've never really had anal. That's crazy because I've had anal. <laughs> I feel like Joe just told a I've fucking done riddle. <laughs> like, what? Well, Thank you. Like, in okay. the middle what of that walks, What walks in the morning? No, but you, <laughs> your rationale what, was what air? What? Because you can't believe that I have never cheated. You guys must have all cheated. That doesn't make sense. No, because everyone in the room was shocked that I've always been faithful. No, it's because you're a raging right. old whore. That means we're, <laughs> we're judging with you. All the Come years on, Lewis. I'm going to step in she's here. Sorry, she's not old. Bobby's not here to defend her. That's kind of accurate. <laughs> 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 but only half accurate. Wait, have you guys she's all cheated on your girlfriend? Have you yeah. guys all cheated on your girlfriend? Uh, I never cheated on a girlfriend. Nope. Never cheated on a girlfriend? No. I believe the fifth. I've been cheated on. I have, I'm, I'm, open, I'm open about Dan. it yeah. get, the, get your head out of your ass. Uh, what I li would like to say is <laughs> my, uh, my corporate sponsors <laughs> would not like wow. this information leaked. Did I have a full-fledged real other relationship while I was with my last girl? Hey, yeah, you've told I don't know if you remember from the earlier thing. Your pregnant girlfriend's in the room. <laughs> she knows ah. what the fuck is up. She, oh. met, she met me when I had a girlfriend. Oh! Hey. Oh. She's a fucking homewrecker. <laughs> Ooh, you tomcat. Oh. No, she wouldn't hook up with me because I, I had a girlfriend. I fucking love Beatrice. I fucking, the way she's oh, just... Oh, well, I don't like him. that you're saying fucking <laughs> so intensely. He never told the story is quite right. He was punching it up, mate. Eh? Joe's texting. Yeah, what's I'm up, texting, texting. I'm reading and listening. He never tells the story is quite right. He would have never I'm done I'm trying to Bobby not here. interrupt. I know. I'm reading it. Five minutes, let's go. No, because yeah. Bobby would go, everyone turn their phones up, dudes. But no one did that. <laughs> I've been cheated on really host. badly. I'm not the host. And I gotta leave as we talk. I'm late for my show because I love you guys. Wait, so how did you how did you get cheated on? And what how did you find out? We've also done it. Oh, how I found out. So uh, the girl called me and left a voicemail on my phone, going, "Hi, I just thought you let you know that me and Aaron have been fucking the whole time. You've been going out with him." And I was like 18. I lost my virginity oh, to him. Is that when you started? Like, oh. Is that when you took gay Aaron's virginity? Wait, is gay, it, gay Joe. Gay Joe. Give yeah. him the fucking bomb. Yeah, claw to him. Why? Because I said the wrong name. Yeah, wrong name. Bomb. Is that a bomb, bomb Joe? Bomb. I like You're the that you called it the bomb cloth. Whatever called cloth. it that. That's hilarious. <laughs> Good job. <laughs> the bomb cloth. It sounds so, like a unit. I never in the got MIPD. it. I'm not relevant. So. There we are. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. right not yeah. listening or not yeah. appreciating. Whoa, let's calm those arms Bomb down, Kelly. Yeah. <laughs> Sounds oh, like a no. unit in the was, NYPD. Oh, That's don't. poetry. My flabby arms are coming back. I'll this take is so it. Depressing. Oh, shut up and show your tits. <laughs> Kelly, do, <laughs> <laughs> do you notice that she keeps sitting like with her elbows back, like yeah. trying to show it off? But I'll tell you no, this, she's pushing her boobs no, forward. because my arms are flabby now. And, and her, her shoulders are about to go through the ceiling. 
kind of laugh was that? That's a noise that Kelly's going to That's a big brother uh, laugh right there. <laughs> from, by the way, from behind, Kelly looks like Dexter. I don't know if you noticed that. <laughs> I don't get that at all. <laughs> you never watched Dexter. <laughs> Chris saved you on that one. <laughs> That's a good one. Pre, that pre, that pre or the... post cancer? No. Which one? Was that the one you've been no, waiting no. on? You've been sitting on a fucking gym for weeks, Lewis? No, by the way, Chris. you going to fucking take it? Kelly. Shut your fucking face. Chris loved that joke. That was a good one. I didn't Thanks. get you it. You do look like Dexter Morgan from the back. <laughs> what the hell? I don't even know what uh, that just got, He's got like weird hair and it's just- Great yeah, muscle tone great, in the back. Great, great, great track. <laughs> <laughs> he's got weird hair and back knee. And, uh, <laughs> <laughs> he's, got the, he's got the shoulders of holy field. You have that, you <laughs> dummy. He looks like a boar. <laughs> Kelly looks like she could punch through a wall with those shoulders. Like a fucking wild hog. <laughs> she did one of those bar <laughs> games where you punch it with pressure. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. yeah, he looks like Kelly really has fucking 26 inch python. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> she said her first two vitamins. She can easily advance the most in this room. Uh, Joe. By the way, Joe has way sexier arms than Kelly. <laughs> Joe's <is> made... <laughs> Those look like, uh, 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 see our dicks. You're a th- <laughs> Baby, can you please nice. just take a picture of Joe and Kelly flexing at the same time? Yeah, 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 We've got that picture already from the one with, I think, Norman. Well, let's get our tits together. <laughs> <laughs> How puffy your nipples are. Yeah, yeah dude, your nipples are like puffing out. Joe, do you like nipples being played with? I got a chocolate chip. You don't like your nipples getting played with? Do I like him getting played with? Yeah. Play with his nipples. Didn't we talk about this in another episode, too? Are we just repeating episodes? <laughs> yes. No. Guys this is all spliced nipples together. Well, we need nipples, Barbie. Buddy. We need Barbie. We do. Barbie. Well, I think we've learned a lesson here today. That we can't. <laughs> we can't do a podcast. This is a Sunday a podcast now. <laughs> that this I shouldn't even guys, be on Riotcast. I think that you guys are fucking being hard on us. I think this is a good podcast. I had fun. I laughed. I've been hard the whole time. <laughs> Kelly's tits. <laughs> Hashtag. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Hashtag saved you. Uh, <laughs> well. Did. Chris, thanks for coming back on the show. Thank you for having me. I appreciate it. And we'll get it. you on with Bobby. Oh, let's do the sponsors. You want to read okay. them out or you want me to do it? I think you before know the you sponsors, we should do the apologies. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Sorry, all of the people that usually listen. <laughs> Sorry to black people. That was that was first, wasn't it? Whoa, well, Sorry to the girl from Big Brother. Again. She sounded like the Whoa. most racist thing of the day. Sorry to black people for everything I've been <laughs> thinking <laughs> in my head every the time faggots. you walk by me. <laughs> And another thing for saying faggot. <laughs> <laughs> With a hard T. I had a very hard T on Sticking faggot. The tea. I'm sorry. All right, Let's little, hear you do the sponsors there. Maybe we're grooming you for your own show. You don't even know. Well, good luck. Good <laughs> luck with all the soda hour. It's just going to be silence and me going. <clears throat> <clears throat> Uh, no, right. I hate that voice. That's all like right. the most annoying voice ever. Hey, here's, our, uh, here's our sponsors. Uh, actually, no, go to riotcast.com backslash Robert Kelly. And then uh, go to the Amazon button. For top right. <laughs> You're awful. Slash? You're I don't know, awful. computer. Fuck you, Lewis. It's the worst plug for any of the sponsors. Amazon. Ever. Go to yeah, the Amazon hey, button. Fuck on, you, Lewis. Go to Amazon. Yeah. <laughs> fuck you, Lewis. I hope I hope Hammer Fisting makes no money off Amazon. We're not Boom. making anything. I hope we get all the money off Amazon. Yeah. Go to Ro- go to forward slash Robert Kelly on Riotcast.com. Amazon button. Click on it. Buy anything. And uh, bookmark it. Bookmark it, and you're helping out the show. And you're helping out yourself by buying stuff. Mm-hmm. Also, want to thank GameFly.com right now. You want to thank them, or do you want to tell people to go there? Are you now? You're he just w- looking. He for wants anything. to do both, dude. Now you just. Th- I want to thank them, and I'm telling people to go there. Get a get a subscription. You get two video games. You get a, you get a trial for twenty one ninety nine. Actually, it's cheaper than that, right, Rob? What's the trial? It's free, you dick. <laughs> It's a free, it's a free trial. trial for 15 days. 15 day free You're trial. You're reading this handwriting. I don't need it because I fucking know the plug. 15 day free trial, two games. It's free. Sign up for the free fucking trial. Go to hammerfisting.com. Yeah. Click on no, 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 no. no. YKWD. YKWD. No, Robert Kelly. Robert, Robert Kelly. No, Riotcast.com slash Robert Kelly. Fucker. Okay. And the, other, and the other sponsors are Cringe Humor as well. Does anyone know when the new club's opening up? Soon. I, 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 no, it's not open. It's, I walked by there yesterday. Not. It's in shambles. It's dust and oh, boards shit. everywhere. Yeah. I yeah. swear to God. I heard it's August 10th. That's what I heard. Yeah. yeah. And uh, laugh button. Laugh button. And laugh spin. Uh, that photo, why was there a massive cardboard cutout of Bobby Kelly in Montreal? Because it was the greatest thing ever. That oh. was the funniest thing. We the just sitting there. The, you walked in and the, just The found guys it? from Laugh Button came downstairs and uh, they were like, we got a full blown. <laughs> cardboard cutout so of Bobby. Funny. Can we do like a fake? You know what, dude? Here in Montreal, I think. I think. By the way, he meant full size. Full size. That's it. Full it by the way, it's really huge. <laughs> <laughs> took three guys to carry it, <laughs> and it's just made of cardboard. Uh, but we did. Uh, we took a couple pictures, and they tweeted it. If you want to go, go to the. Uh, I think it's at Laugh Button on Twitter. They have a bunch of yeah. pictures of uh, Joe the Truthless and I up in Montreal. Yeah, with nice. uh, with Bobby. 
Well, anyway. cardboard cutout Bobby. Cardboard Who's still smoking. The cardboard cutout. Yeah. Still smoking. Looks really creepy. And consumer and uh, Yowza Fitness as well. Um, if you're a fat fuck, go to Yowza Fitness. Dude, you <laughs> can take the thing. You can fold it up, dude. I watched the TV the other day and I ran for 45 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> nah, I'll Kelly on that one. is... <laughs> Gain and weight. Oh. Uh, I think that is like the pot calling the kettle fat, you full fat fucks. I'm losing weight. Whoa. I'm, All I'm, of you. I'm, you I'm, I'm trimming up. Shit. Are you fucking crazy? Fuck I'm getting, you. I'm on GHB. I'm getting yoked. GHB. Yeah. <laughs> You're supposed GHB. to work oh, out, not GHB. <laughs> <laughs> You're taking a day rape drug? <laughs> HGH? <laughs> what the fuck right. are you talking about? Dude's <laughs> date raping himself in his apartment. <laughs> All right. I'll never remember this. <laughs> <laughs> as much as date rape's good, we got to wind this up, guys. Whoa. Uh, All right, everyone do their plugs. Let's go around. Luis Gomez. Uh, you guys can uh, visit me at Comic Dave Smith on Twitter. <laughs> <laughs> he has like 90 followers. The kid's got it. He needs some help. Yeah. Sprance. Sprance. Glory Hole Podcast and RyeCast.com. The RyeCast app is coming out very soon. Check out all the great shows of RyeCast. Which I saw today, which is fucking unbelievable. I cannot even believe You don't even know. You fucking don't even. It's I right, gonna, No one else has got anything it. like it. It's coming out. <laughs> Kelly's verbally blowing you. <laughs> it was the fucking greatest thing I've ever seen in my life. And I saw a roo give birth once. It was the greatest thing ever. <laughs> Sexy Chris Stefano. Um, Twitter's at Christy Comedy. Uh, <laughs> he'll be finger banging strippers in a that. city near you. <laughs> oh wait, when am I? Well, yeah, I'll be gone for the next. When? When does it come out? Next I don't week? Know. Like God only. Yeah, it doesn't matter. We don't even know if it's this not is coming out. No, 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 hold on. Let me. Let me. We don't even know if this thing's gonna see the can daylight. I plug, can I plug some shows real quick Ooh. this Sick. month? Yeah. All right, next Wednesday, uh, which is probably be out. Dude, give me. the nah. dates because you don't know when it's coming. Levity, out. Levity, levity, uh, three weeks. Three All right, weeks, then uh, fucking uh, August twenty fourth and twenty fifth, mm-hmm. I'm with Big J Okerson in Rhode Island at uh, the Comedy Connection. Connection. There you go. East um, Providence. Joe, the truth list. What do you got? Uh, I'm trying to find the name of the joint. But September 28th, September 28th, that's not that far away. It's called The Spot Ooh. in Providence, Rhode Island also. Oh, shit. Oh, yeah. Can I do one then? Can I, can I do I got. Can I get um, August 25th at the Borgata? Oh, we'll oh do. And oh. September 12th, Caroline's. Who are you at? Nice. Uh, open up for Artie Lang at the Borgata. Oh, nice. August 25th. Look at the kid. The good old Artie Lang. Ooh. Look at the kid. What about you, Danny? Uh, uh, if you're in Seattle, I'll be there uh, the first through the third doing Bumber Shoot. Music festival. Bumber shoot. <laughs> yeah, it's a, it's it's a, a club music or festival. something gay you're doing. It's then. a big music festival. Jane's Addiction and Tony Bennett. So, there you and, go. Uh, wow. Literal Dan. Okay. Boom. And Literal. I will be having my plugs uh, stepped over by Chris DeStefano and Dan Soto. <laughs> <laughs> also, I'll be at the Palisades Comedy Club with Bobby <laughs> Kelly. <laughs> September 13th. It's not the Palisades Comedy Club. You jerk off. It's Levity Live. Levity Live. Which, Palisades by the way, is that club is beautiful. Right, right, well, I'll be at Levity Live with yeah. Bobby. And I'll be there next Wednesday. Well, I'll Amazing be there club. September 13th. It's my hometown. <laughs> well, this is Bobby's podcast. Go fuck yourself. Joe, Joe, do you want to give you the plugs again? No, I don't. I don't want anyone to come to my show. Chris and Lewis and Dan are all more important than me. Joe, do you want to plug your mouth closed with a Tootsie Roll? Kelly, anything? Nope. Uh, okay, good happening. <laughs> All right. Go, Kelly, go. You got one? Kelly, anything. I'm at the open mic at the... Uh, Let's let her do her thing, but still end the podcast with Lewis's burn. Can you edit that? <laughs> but yeah, go for a while. Uh, that's fine. Just follow me on Twitter. Follow at, at Kelly Fastuga, F-A-S-T-U-C-A, Fastuga. <laughs> and uh, Bobby will be back next time. I think you did a good job, Dan. Thanks. Great job. You know I did as well. Good job, I everybody. I disagree more. Let's all suck each other off. <laughs> what? You know what?